Hi guys, it's Jimmy McIntyre here. Welcome to the second video in this series of tutorials where we'll be looking at lesser known but very useful functions in Photoshop. Today we're going to learn how we can make specific changes to our image based purely on color. And we're going to do that surprisingly by using a black and white adjustment layer. So let me show you what I mean. If we go to the adjustment panel here, we can open up a black and white adjustment layer. And of course the image goes black and white. Now we change the blend mode of this layer to luminosity. And essentially what that means is whatever changes we're going to make on this black and white layer, it will only affect the brightness values of this layer and not the saturation of the colors. So with the black and white layer open, I want to try and bring out some more details in these rocks in the foreground here. And I can do that by going to the yellow slider and moving it to the right. And you can see how it's brightened up this area. Next, I want to make the water around here frothier to exaggerate that long exposure effect that I got through the ND filter that I used. And I can do that by going to cyans and sliding them to the right too. And see if I slide to the left it'll go darker and if I slide to the right it'll go brighter. And essentially what we're doing is making changes based on a very narrow range of colors. Now when we're finished, if we're happy with that, I can close it and choose a paintbrush and a black mask. And I can just mask this part out because I didn't want to affect it. I just wanted to affect the foreground. So here is the before and after. You can see we've brought out more details in the rocks and we've added to the frothy soft feel of the water. Another example of how we can use this black and white layer is if we have a blue hour shot like this and we feel maybe the sky isn't as dark as we'd like it to be because we shot it a little bit early to get into the deep blue hour. With the black and white layer open and of course the blend mode at luminosity we can open up this layer and scroll down to blues and we just need to drag the blues down ever so slightly and maybe the cyans too. And there's the before and after. We now have a much darker deeper blue hour. And just to reinforce this idea, I have a shot here from a Kyoto bamboo forest. And if we open up the black and white layer, I can make specific changes to the trees. I can brighten them up through the green and yellow sliders. And I can even affect the trunks of the trees here by using the red slider. So I can brighten them and darken them as I see fit. And there's the before and after. Okay, as usual, I hope you've enjoyed this quick tutorial. And if you want to see more tutorials, please feel free to subscribe to my YouTube channel.